Sharp games are frequently the result of starting with the king's pawn since it dominates the center and frees up the bishop and queen on the light squares. While preparing for d5, the French defense prevents the light squared bishop in favor of a strong center and opportunities for counterattacks. The center is fully controlled by d4 and the dark squared bishop is made available. The e4 pawn is threatened by the center counterattack on d5. The white side's x5 strategy against the French defense is not the most daring, but it does allow for simple development with nf3, bd3, and 0 to 0 in the near future. x5 recaptures the d5 pawn and allows the light squared bishop to develop. nf3 controls the e5 square, advances the knight toward the center, and helps the d4 pawn. nf6 develops the knight toward the center, supports the d5 pawn and controls the e4 square. bd3 develops the light squared bishop to a central square and prepares castling. bd6 develops the bishop toward the center and prepares to castle king's side. This activates a queen by developing it off of its starting square. It is the last book move. This blocks the check from an opposing queen. It is good.